I'm gonna let you behind the curtain a little bit and show you our prototype process. We got a bunch of messages and emails last night on the IC4. So the IC4 is Schwinn's latest model of spin bike. It's also the same as the Bowflex C6. There are two prices there, so if you're in the market, look them both up. It's the same bike, different branding, different prices. Anyway, once we got the IC4 in the shop, we recognized quickly that the handlebar structure is just not conducive to our traditional spin tray design. We knew we were gonna have to use the universal model. Now we've been working on the universal model for months, trying to come up with the right design, and we're really close. So what you see behind me, sitting on a Peloton here, is a prototype. So I'll zoom in in a minute and show you, but there are some swivel components in here and clamps. So yes, it clamps to the handlebars. It can still be quickly removed, not as fast as a traditional spin tray. There's gotta be some trade-off. There isn't a magical solution to solve all of the problems. There's gonna be some added cost to this too because of the mechanical components, so keep that in mind. Um, we're trying to keep it reasonably priced, but we don't know exactly where that price is gonna land. Um, but we're aware that it has to make sense, and if it's too expensive, you're not gonna buy it. We so get it. We believe that it's gonna cover most of the major bikes in the industry. We don't have them all, so we're not gonna be able to test it all, um, but we are gonna go with Universal. So if you're interested, and you have a bike that doesn't fall in line or that we have listed, Feel free to try it out, buy it, or return your money if it doesn't work. Here, I'm gonna show you kind of a closer view. Come on, camera. Oh, no. There we go. So you can see that there is um, some swivel structure in here. It's all collapsed right now to the lowest height setting. Um, I kind of did that intentionally to sort of disguise what's going on here. Um, and then this clamp right here, uh, that you can see will clamp onto the handlebars. And then there's um, gonna be a mounting structure here. Again, this is a prototype model. So this is not going to be uh, the final form by any means. Um, I'm still tired. So again, there's gonna be a structure right here. These clamps are gonna be able to move up and down on the tray. You've got this clamp structure and then swivel mounts here to allow you to move these arms in, in any position that is convenient for you. In fact, you're gonna be able to take these arms and move them out of the way and still give, your, um, give yourself the ability to hold on to handlebars, um, which I know that some people have asked for uh, with the regular spin tray. So this may solve some issues. Like if you're watching Netflix or you're on a Zoom meeting, you'll still be able to reach around or underneath the tray and hold on to the handlebars for stability while your computer is mounted up in front of you. So this is just an update for the people that are asking we are working as hard as we can to get this out and available for the holiday season, preferably sooner. Keep an eye on Instagram and Facebook at The Real Spin Tray. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, topformdesign.com is our website. You can go there and get updates as well. Please stay with us. Thank you.